What's up guys, Vern here, Poggy Boy Productions. Well, you're probably wondering how we did it, right? How we managed to go to Washington DC for one whole day. Well, you're, you come to the right video, I'll show you exactly how we did it, how much we paid, where we went, and uh, what exactly does it take to do it, right? And we managed to do it all spontaneously, so keep watching. Washington on standby if you want to know how I did this keep watching here at Newark Airport early in the morning all right I managed to fly using what they call through the airlines the buddy pass system I have a brother that works for the airport in this case United Airlines and he has privileges that allow you to buy a ticket for a discounted price in short I paid about $70 for a ticket to fly round trip from New Jersey to Washington DC Got my cherry on with me, ready to go on a trip. Not bad, right? Some things to consider if you decide to use the Buddy Pass. Number one, be flexible. This is not a guaranteed ticket. This means you are flying as a chance passenger. So if the plane is fully booked and depending on how long the standby list is to fly, you may have to wait until the next open flight. For example, there was an instance where I was stuck in Chicago for two days. It was during spring break season. I should have listened to my brother. I ended up sleeping in the airport. Number two, fly direct. It will keep your costs low and you don't have to get multiple buddy passes. So if you have to make a stopover, say Detroit, going to your final destination, that would be two buddy passes. I believe they call this segments. Lastly, do your research. Find the best days to fly. Non-holidays, early mornings. Make advanced preparations in case you are stuck, like book a hotel if you don't want to sleep in the airport. Check with the person who booked whether the flight has any open seats. They have access to a website, so that will make it a little bit easier to see whether or not you will have to take that buddy pass. So hopefully these tips will give you some insight whether or not to use the buddy pass on your next flight. And now, Let's head over to Washington, D.C. Finally here in Washington, D.C. Let's start this trip. in DC. You super clean. You cleaner than New York City. Wow. Anyway, let's continue exploring. I'm gonna eat in a bit. We are back. Found good parking. I like the buildings here. It's so you different, I like old fashioned. Some kind of rally going on in front of the White House. Don't know what it is. All right, let's keep walking. State's Court of Appeal. This building looks very old. It looks like a ancient. I don't know if you can see it. It's McKinley's house. President McKinley's. Little White House. Here we are. The White House. I'm looking for Mr. Joe Biden. It's like a white wall there. I guess enough crazy people start to go in. There's the White House. Treasury Department. Where all our money goes.
and some ice cream. Oh, they have SpongeBob too, your favorite. How are you? Hello. Oh, they got shaved ice. You want shaved ice? I can't finish that. You make me finish that, Kyle, right? <laughs> and strawberry for KB. Oh, that's big. That's a lot. A lot of ice. Here's the obelisk tower. Looking for Abraham Lincoln, he lives in there. Better shot of the triangle thingy there. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, time to go up the stairs. Go visit Abraham Lincoln. Kids are hungry for some croissants, so we're gonna go inside for some French bakery. Well, hope you guys enjoyed that video. One day trip to Washington DC. Got to see a lot of the main sites like uh, Abraham Lincoln and the White House and uh, the tower. I forgot what you call that. Um, I think if you're going to do the buddy pass system and want to spend more days, I recommend just buying a plane ticket. Um, right now, I think a lot of people are flying to Newark, New Jersey. A lot of people are flying to Newark, New Jersey. So. I won't be able to get on the first or first two flights, but there's a third one that's pretty empty. So yeah, make sure you a lot a lot of time if you are gonna do the body pass system. It's cheap. Yeah, you just gotta do a lot of waiting. So yeah, if you plan to stay a little longer, recommend buying a ticket. Plan your days. Um, if you, especially if you want to see museums or if you wanna check out another state. I think Maryland's an hour away from here, so yeah, not bad at all. And we ate some good food. We ate the Poggy Boy Burger coming soon. And we had the croissant, which was good. So, uh, yeah. That's all for today. If you like this video, click that subscribe button down below if you haven't yet. Ring the bell so you get notified of all our future videos. Like, comment, and share. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.